Hey Pre-K, I have a question for you. How many shapes can you think of? I'm going to count down from 10 and in those 10 seconds I want you to shout out as many different shapes as you can think of. Are you ready? Okay, here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Did you shout out circle, square, triangle, rectangle, diamond, oval? Any other shapes that I didn't say? Today we are going to read a story that is all about shapes but they are shapes that you see when you are outside. I bet you've seen all of those shapes we mentioned when you're outside taking a walk or even in your house, or if you were on vacation, you probably saw some of these shapes, or when we were at school, I'm sure you saw these shapes. So today we're gonna to read a story about New York City, which is, remember when we read Entangle Makes Three? That's where that story took place as well. And this one is called City Shapes. And it's about all the shapes that you can see when you're in New York City. And I want you to be thinking as we're reading where you might have seen some of these shapes. What shapes do you see on this page? Do you see any round shapes on this page? No, me neither. City shapes. A pigeon takes flight through the bright cityscape, exploring the scenery, shape after shape. The city is bursting with shapes of each kind, and if you look closely, who knows what you will find. A truck rumbling by to deliver the mail, a silvery cart with hot pretzels for sale, and stacks of brown packages hauled up the stairs. What shapes do you see on this page? Look at the windows and the boxes and the truck. Some shapes in the city are on the go squares. A skyscraper covered in shimmery glass, a long metal bench near a green patch of grass and a table with glittery scarves and gold bangles Some shapes in the city are dazzling rectangles. The seaport with all of the flowing white sails and there in the market, the pointy fish tails and colorful flags on a banner of bangles. What color, I mean, what shape are those flags? There's two shapes there. One has four sides and one has three sides. Some shapes in the city are gleaming triangles. The sunglasses worn by a cop on his beat, the wheels of the taxis that zip down the street, and a manhole that leads to the pipes underground. Hmm, what shape do you think it is? I'll give you a clue. This is a manhole. What shape is that? Some shapes in the city are circles so round. At sunset, the city is softly aglow as chit-chatting crowds hustle bustle below. When off in the distance, a melody hums. It's hard not to follow the sound of the drums. What shape are those drums? And what shape do you see down here at the bottom? And all those colors. And what about the buildings? What shape are those buildings over there? And the lights, what shape are the lights on top of the subway? The stage in the park where the instruments sing. Some shapes in the city are ovals that swing. And nearby the kites seem to dance in the sky. Some shapes in the city are diamonds that fly. The sun fades away into hazy blue dark, and soon there's a twinkle, a glimmer, a 
spark. Scattered up high above buildings and cars, some shapes in the city are far away stars. The pigeon that flies back through the night cityscape as city lights sparkle shape after shape, but her heart starts to ache for the shape she loves best, the shape that is home. Her warm circle nest. The pigeon's nest is a circle. Where the whirring and beeping of cars rushing by helps her fall fast asleep like a sweet lullaby. The end. Lily has a really fun shape activity for you to do for math today. So make sure you check that out.